subscribe and press the bell icon for more new owls related content. Welcome to my channel, I'm Japneet. In today's video, we are going to discuss few words and their beautiful synonyms. Uh, basically, this is a series in which we are going to discuss about those words which we can use in task 2 and speaking and their synonyms. Okay, so this is basically the first part, and the series is coming, uh, next parts are coming. So, without wasting any time, let's get started. Let's begin. Firstly, we are going to talk about television. What else can we say to television? The first synonym is an idiot box. Yes, you have heard it correctly, an idiot box. The second one is a magical box and the third is silver screen. Now, what is silver screen? You may have heard celebrities saying this word many times. Uh, for example, that person is going to debut uh, on the silver screen. Okay, That means that the person is going to make his first appearance on the TV. Let's take a look at the examples. First is Mr. Amitabh Bachchan is a legend of silver screen. Second example is she suddenly declared that she wouldn't have an idiot box in her home. Now let's move to the second word that is remain stick to. Now what does it mean? If you are spending a lot of time in front of your magical box that means TV then you uh, remain stick to it. What else can we say to remain stick to? The first is remain glued to as we know glue is a gum right now the next example uh, the next synonym is uh, remain hooked to okay now comes the example uh, many youngsters remain glued to television for a long time okay. with this there's one more word uh, that is called sedentary lifestyle now what is sedentary lifestyle it means uh, if a person spends a lot of time uh, just by sitting uh, then uh, we can use this word that the person has a sedentary lifestyle okay let's move to the example sedentary lifestyle leads to many diseases now the third vocabulary word diseases there are around four words uh, we can use in place of diseases the first one is uh, health hassles next is health maladies next is uh, health hazards and the last is ailments let's take our previous example that was sedentary lifestyle leads to many diseases uh, and now we'll use uh, these words in place of diseases we can use any of these words such as uh, sedentary lifestyle leads to many health hazards the fourth word is pollute so here's uh, the beautiful synonyms degrade distort deform deteriorate degenerate we are using these words in place of pollute not pollution okay so there are another words for pollution these are just for pollute for example if we have we are uh, have to say that uh, this thing pollute environment okay pollutes environment so here's the example a considerable rise in the number of vehicles degrade our environment okay degrades our environment that means pollute our environment if uh, it is pollution then we can use these words degradation distortion deformation deterioration degeneration you can write it down or you can take the screenshot as well for example vehicles uh, lead to environmental degradation now uh, the last is serious results so here are the synonyms okay if there is any problem that causes serious results then we can use these words the first one is uh, serious re repercussions another one is grave consequences now let's take a look at the example fast food leads to serious repercussions so this is the first part with few words i hope uh, these are clear and you can use these in speaking and in task two and as i have mentioned earlier that we are going to uh, discuss about more words in the next parts so if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are new and please share it with your friends thank you